Mike Hookham, what's the message that you're trying to convey today? Uh, conflict resolution, and I think somebody's already said it should be George or not World War. We have to speak. Uh, we have to talk to Mr. Putin, uh, and I think Donald Trump is actually doing that, unbelievably. Uh, and, you know, if you want to, before you have a war, you need to stop that war, and the only way to do that is to talk to people and, uh, and you know, sit around the table. Uh, no, nobody wants war, no, nobody wants, uh, you know, conflict, and I think that the way to go forward is to sit down and, and talk. Does the EU have any role to play in this? Uh, no, I'm totally against the European Union. The European Union, as I, as I say, when I voted into it, was an economic trading bloc. That's what it should stay as. It should have any role. Uh, there's obviously people within there that are trying to make it a federal state of Europe. I think that worries Mr. Putin with the, with the military, uh, the military connotations that that has. Uh, myself, I believe, and my party believe that the European Union should be gone as a federal state. It should be a trading state only. So who would keep the peace in the world? NATO is already there. We've already got that set up. The, Europe, uh, the United Nations, yes, it's been said that the United Nations is a toothless tiger. Well, rather than just getting rid of that, I think we, we need to make the United Nations work for you know, what it was set up to do. No, you. No, I'm, 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 as I say, I'm totally against it. I'm totally against the European Army, European Navy, European Air Force. You know, we, we should be a sovereign nation of, of Great Britain, uh, and we have our own army, our own Air Force, and, you know, that's what I believe in. You know, I signed up uh, when I was in my late teens. Uh, I, you know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a patriotic man, and I believe in my country.